our live stream. Good evening, good morning, and good afternoon. So, if you're in the Philippines, uh, I'm going to say good evening. So, welcome back to our live stream. But um, before I start, guys, let me hear or let me know if you guys hear me. Can you hear me? Uh, because I don't know. I'll try to check my connection. I think it's down. So hopefully my internet was good today. So that would be nice. And thank you so much everyone who were waiting um, our live stream. So... Is it clear guys? Is that okay? Can you hear me? And that would be nice. Thank you so much. So I know someone's here. Ricardo Smith, good morning to you. Uh oh, I don't know guys. I am not sure about my internet today, so hopefully. So I was trying. Uh, is your brown out in the prologue? Um, no, it's no brown out today. So. Okay, thank you so much, Ricardo. And let us welcome to my new subscriber. Thank you so much. And all to all of you guys, I know to my loyal subscribers, thank you for supporting me. I've been watching all my video and leaving a thumbs up and you know from the first, you know, and also to my new subscriber, thank you so much for um, supporting this channel I so appreciate it thank you so much you guys so Norman Spanish good morning or good afternoon to you Norman how are you today and yes thank you so much for giving a thumbs up in our live guys so I'm always say at the beginning that thank you so much everyone who was supporting watching all my video and you know um, because of you guys I am inspired that's why I'm here um, I'll be able to continue my channel you know I'm so inspiring because of you guys you know it's such a good feeling that um, you're always there you know um even i'm not really good to do a vlog but this channel is about um making great memories in my life wherever i go and documented all uh, my lifestyle here in the province in a small province so that's my vlog about it and um if you guys interested you know i have like videos if you take a look back you know thank you so much for that and also um because a bit busy in this uh, position that i got so um this is why i'm not really kind of you know uh, making video every week twice you know uploading twice a week so but i tried my best if i can you know trying to making videos hang out you know especially but i love to so and i have a coming video hopefully you will watch that and yes probably i'm gonna you know tomorrow it's my day off so yeah that's gonna be exciting you know but not really exciting because um tomorrow i'm going to visit my mom and after that i'm gonna process my uh, vox, vox certificate 
tomorrow I will practice that because I will be going to travel to the Maggette for my uh, one month training in uh, HR office at main branch of the Maggette so that's I'm going to um, that's my day tomorrow guys so after visiting mom I will process that and because that's one of the requirements when you know um, I will be entering to Dumaguete you know the VAX, VAX certificate and the vaccination card so we'll see about that guys tomorrow so is everyone is here how are you guys doing <clears throat> so um let us um join everyone our live chat guys if you wanted us questions you know um i know you've been really exciting um traveling to philippines or around uh, provinces or um places in Mindanao that you've been love to travel so that's gonna be exciting to you guys and hopefully please join our live chat if you guys want a questions or want to know um Filipino vlogger is here so So I had only few subscribers join our live chat, but hopefully don't hesitate guys to join, you know. Jandi, good morning to you, Jandi. How are you today? You look so great this morning. Thank you so much. John D. Hello Earl, good morning to you. How are you today? Thank you for um, dropping in my channel. I know it's but I still appreciate you guys your time, you know. It would be nice, you know, woke up in the morning, have a cup of coffee while watching Filipino Vloggers Live. That's awesome. Spring weather here, warm days and cold nights. I love it. Wow, that's gonna be looks like um, perfect weather. You know, spring. It's not too cold. It's not rainy. It sounds like um, you know, fun to go out exploring with the spring spring weather. So like always today, guys. Here in Bicolo, it's we had so sunny today so we had a good reader today here lee hill good morning to you hello beautiful man thank you hill uh, welcome how are you today you're absolutely right that's exactly what i'm doing enjoying a cup of hot coffee wow thank you so much earl i'm so glad <laughs> yes it's always good in my feelings that you know i've been doing live stream talking like this and if you guys you know joining our live chat you know it's such a, a good feelings that you know i can able to talk to you even i'm not talking to you but um but uh, showing joining our life so that this kind of um you know like a good feelings that um i can able to talk to you if, if you guys wanna you know it's just a small things that we can share an idea or you know if you guys had a questions you know just join our live chat 
it's free to join guys we're just friends in here that you know sharing an idea or opinion so please join our live chat guys so that i know that you there you know watching this live even my friends i don't know if my friends in here people you know at work filipino subscriber i hope you guys joining in here and i'd like to shout out thank you so much um for my work you know my friends spice girls so is everyone welcome in our live chat i will be coming to the polog in july that's good that's awesome you know um so you gotta say the date planning to go visit to the polog um welcome soon ricardo how is the weather around september not real rainy time for a year um september i think that's gonna be it's not so rainy days but yeah sometimes we encounter that um july august september you know october it's kind of it's not always raining it let us go like that but you know if you really want to come planning to philippines if you enjoy the weather it's gonna be month of march april may so you're gonna love it enjoy that weather here guys because that's our summer time but by month of september expected that early it's a uh, rainy season <laughs> So, George Blanket, hello, good morning to you. Raf Jamrak, good morning. How are you today? That's cool. Weather in Florida. So sunny. It's like here in the Pollock, it's so sunny today. Archwin Kali Nation. Hi, Ati, Win May here. So, Win May. I forgot. So, what do you to do? Hi, me. I forgot. Yeah, shout out to you, Winme. From Tagaminao, Kadaino. I'm not sure if you're sorry. I'm not sure if you're sorry. I'm not sure if you're sorry. I'm not sure if me. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot. So shout out to you, Win May from the Pollock City. Are there any restrictions or changes happening right now that you are aware of? No, it's not gonna change. Um it's not gonna change the travel update is the same guys because we are still in level two. So that's a good thing. George Plunkett, how are you doing? Hope you have a great week and have some fun this week. Um, thank you so much, George Plunkett. But it's not really like fun because you know working and kind of um go and visit to mom. So it's gonna be more fun that I can be able to explore and traveling. So yes. Kung naman to si Win Me asa galik ka Win Win Me. Rock jump rock. Do you know how to ride a scooter? Um because i'm just new practicing but when you say i can ride in a scooter yes i can but um, i'm not really can't drive in a highway because i don't have a license so 
So, yes, I can drive a scooter, but I need more practice, especially in the highways. You know, because a lot of vehicles, you know. And also, I don't have that license. Getting a live scooter would be awesome. And yes, guys, I have only a few subscribers joining in here, but hopefully everyone is free to ask. Please join our live chat so that I know that you guys are here. Are you here, everyone? <laughs> So where is the other? And also thank you for leaving a thumbs up in our live live chat guys in our live stream only. Or a thing let me switch on more lights so that here we go. Is it clear? Sorry guys, um, I was just get close to the phone and scroll down because this is the way how I do my life. Very close. We are bad. I'm sorry, but it is really bad. Not this week, it's been down. Our, uh, not this week, it's been down. Our, uh, internet connection. So, so crazy. It seems you are having more rain than usual this year. Yes, um, it depends guys when uh, when they have a low pressure and that's expect that gonna have more rains yeah <coughs> oh my god <sighs> excuse me guys excuse me for that <laughs> Jenny, you hello, welcome to our live stream. Jenny, what happened between you and retiring in paradise? Um, that's gonna be a long, long way, but thank you for being in my life and ask uh, question, your questions. So you know if you followed me on um my previous previous live or if you update on my video but since you're new to my channel so i'm going to answer your questions that about uh, what happening with retiring in paradise so it's not only been like thrice or four times that we split you know i'm going back and you know split and wanted to get back so that's the last time i was not you know um getting back with him because how many times that i caught in that apartment that he had a girls so um so we seen the girls that you know we broke up so but I am moved on now because that's a year and um, is it two months? So 
since we uh, finished our relationship with Vitaly in Paradise. So only me that I saw with the girls, um, also in Lip Plaza because if you ask the employees of Lip Plaza, only the regular employees of the Lip Plaza knows about him, you know, that he always seen with the girls, different girls, but that's not me, so it's always with the girls, so that's, that's, you know, I'm kind of, I'm gonna move up and, you know, um, you know, I was just, I want peaceful, you know, like, always, you know, um, asking in myself that, you know, why I can, you know, force myself, you know, with this always problem with girls and girls, so I'm gonna move out, and yeah, it's already moved on. Ouch. I'm sorry, my fault. Apologize, guys. My phone fell in, in my table. Uh -oh. That's okay. That's okay. I am so shocked. I don't want to broke up my phone. <laughs> so, Lee, you are losing your connection in and out. Yes, apologize for that, guys. I don't know. So it's down until now. The internet connection was down, and I don't know. So because just only using my phone, mobile data. So um, sometimes expect that you know the internet connection is down. So Jen, you, uh, where are you from? Peter T, hello from Australia. How are you today, Peter T? Bless you, maybe you are allergic to something. <laughs> ah, thank you. Yes, it's true sometimes when I, you know, like the dust, if dusty, but so dusty in my room because. I'm not cleaning yet <laughs> in the floor. <laughs> yeah, tomorrow I'm gonna. Uh, clean that so yes thank you uh, rock, rock, jump, rock. I think you are better off without him yes I think so if you can see now um, no stress in life you know I've been mean moved on like it's not only uh, people in the plus asking me that I look like different now than before that I'm so skinny because I'm I don't know is it called stress or I don't know guys <laughs> so yeah I'm kind of move a long time and you know life must go on and enjoy you know no matter what the past or my experience so this is the main reason that in you know, a total scare but you no know, um, I don't want that to happen again, you know, so I don't want, you know, wasting time with that, you know, so let us be mature enough thinking about, you know, it's not just playing around with girls because um, I'm not a young, young uh, woman anymore, so yes. Jenny, you are enjoyed watching your vids because I'm from Dipolog. Thanks answering my questions. Oi, from Dipolog. Asa man, asa po kayo sa Dipolog, uh, Miss Jenny. Anyway, thank you, Miss Jenny, for joining and welcome to my channel. Leo, you seem like a very good person. You deserve a good man in your life. Hopefully, I always keep praying that, you know, I can find a decent man that, you know, to be with me, you know, just, um, you know, like, um, accept me who I am, you know, like, just, you know, easy 
to go, you know, like fun to be like with me. Um, we had both chemistry and enjoying life together, you know. And the most thing is, I don't want that play girl saying, you know, no, I don't, I hate that. So, I wish I could find a man that stick to one, that only one, that's only me, not just with seeing around girls if they seem beautiful uh, Filipina woman so Maru is hello how are you can I ask an advice what about single moms um for me it's single moms it doesn't care that you know if you're dating single mom is it okay with you that you accept his or her child so um it's as long as you both happy together fun to be with you know it's not stressful life you know it's not like that so it doesn't doesn't mean that single mom you know as long as you know how to look forward in your future uh future life you know you know like happy together so that's it's not uh, not choosing that single mom or single woman. It's it's up to you guys as long as you got comfortable, happy to go, uh, you know. That's most important thing. Yeah. Cedric Edward, good evening to you, Cedric. How are you today? Any plans? To explore um, next, Mr. Cedric. <laughs> Manoj Fernando, good evening to you. Welcome. Sounds like uh, my other subscriber. Thank you for um, having back in my life. How are you today, Manoj Fernando? I think you will find a good man soon and you will be happy and lots of good times ahead of you. Yes, always praying that George Plunkett and thank you so much. Thank you all of you guys, your kind words to me and supporting me um, through all of this, my journey and even in my bad past experience and you still um, comforting me, you know, to continue about this channel, you know, the life must, you know. So it's kind of, I was like thinking, yes, I'm so still blessed that I have you guys, you know, supporting me, giving a good advice. So thank you so much for that. Christian Bourget, good evening to you, Christian. How are you today? Any plans to go out this week? Sounds like you're enjoying here in Philippines. <laughs> Thank you so much, Christian. Jenny, you did you confront the girl on him when caught them? That's heartbreaking. You deserve better. Um, last time when I go in that place, the girl, that's my, my, I know that girl, so he could not, uh, she, she would not speak to me, you know, because Joe was, you know, like, uh, trying to push me, go out that house at that night, so she trying to push me to go out, I, I would able to, to confront and talk to that girl that Joe would let me in so so as an educated you know woman so you could not you know make a scandal with scandalism with that in his apartment so I'm gonna move out and pick up my things and then I go yeah Cedric Edward should be there before end of the month. Wow. Okay, welcome back 
to the Pollard son, Mr. Cedric Edwards. So, I know this is the right time that you guys um seeing if you planning to travel to around philippines and this is the right time right time to you guys to explore yes white van man good afternoon to you if the pandemic was not here i think marianne would have been snapped up months ago <laughs> oh no yeah i think so i should go run <laughs> no i would love to uh, see all my subscribers you know visited here so seeing in person so that would be nice do you guys have restriction still in the follow or do you not have wear mask anymore. Um, we still had wearing masks because that's our protocols that we follow. Also, wearing mask, social distancing. So we still have that restrictions. So even at work, we still uh, wearing face mask. You know. And yes, I have only a couple of um, subscribers joining our live chat tonight, guys. But hopefully everyone will join in if you guys uh, want the questions, you know. So hopefully everyone will join. So I am here. It's free to us, guys. <laughs> and also we can share an ideas and have some of my subscribers already here in Philippines, I think. I think, I think so. <laughs> okay, if you hear that background noise. So that's the only, only way also that we need the patients, if you hear that. <laughs> Dogs always barking at night. We're just singing anyway. <laughs> and thank you so much for giving a thumbs up, guys. Thank you so much, Christian, for reminding a thumbs up. <laughs> I so appreciate. It is raining again, but it's not too hard. John, do I want? To go to the prologue, but I still don't want to take the wax if I don't have to. I'm considering Sinovac, but I won't take this in me near the type. Mm, yes, and speaking of the wax vaccination card, I think it's. They are not, uh, they still prioritize that if you able to travel to Philippines, this is gonna um, um, seeing your vac vaccination cards. Yeah. Even domestic, if if I go travel to Dumaguete or Cebu or something like that, we still need to show your vaccination card. So. Um, it's up to you guys if you had not taken yet the uh, VAX and yeah. So I think we still wait hopefully um, 
few months the restriction will listen uh, less lesson so hopefully so we will um, we'll pray that hopefully soon Lee Hill same here Joe what do you mean Lee job is dangerous mm. So you have not taken yet your uh, vax, Mr. Lee? Yeah, I've already done my two. I took Pfizer, so yeah. i done my first job and second job. And booster, I'm not quite sure about the booster. I think it's enough with the vaccination. What are the new stores in Li Plaza? New store? What they have been doing there? Um, still, they have new what store in Li Plaza, but if you're trying to have a look to, uh, in um Le plaza and department store try to have a look around and they have not new yet so you mean the new store yeah i mean they have like uh how do you call that Q's food stand so they have that Let's see um I'm planning on taking my 20 years old son with me and I sure don't want him to take the box. Yes, it's, you know, everyone, each of us, we had an opinion and, you know, um, it's that's our choice. So, um, we can wait. Hopefully, it, the travel restriction will listen so that one day, you know, hopefully, it will, we're not sure because always, travel restrictions always change. So, we will see that. I meant agree with, ah, uh, okay, <laughs> just talk. I was always confused with the name of Joe because Joe Stalker. That is John D. <laughs> okay, thank you. Uh, Lee, that's for message for Jill Stoker. That is John D. <laughs> so I was for I was four years old when my older brother got myocard myocarditis. So I'm speaking from experience. Yes, that's okay. It's that you know, um, if it's that your opinion, you know, you had to, um, you know, what do you call it? Your opinion. We have to, how do you call that? You know, uh, consider because each of us, you know, we had. Um, choices so and yes it is guys I was also planning to uh, I got the schedule to took my vacation leave for two days to go travel to Aligwai Island to join that, uh, you know, travelers and the cup post, but um, things may change because I'm gonna process my vaccine, vaxer to go travel to Dumaguete. Um, maybe if I finish that um, first week of April, hopefully. 
so yeah but we'll see i still keep letting you guys letting you know i'm gonna keep posted on making a video about that so that you will know so but i'm kind of excited to go uh to go meet new um place in Dovagete and especially our head office is in the uh, in Dumaguete. So I'm so excited to meet with that. Yes. And seeing around Dumaguete, so I'm gonna probably make a vlog for that. Kind of exciting guys. <laughs> What's your favorite Filipino food? Um, grilled. So, is that doesn't matter. Is that uh, grilled pork or fish? So as long as the grilled, I like that. Grilled pork, grilled fish, grilled shrimps. Mm, I love that food. I'm a grilled lover food. <laughs> Yes. And hopefully everyone will join me to our live shop, guys. It's free to join. Don't hesitate to, you know, if you guys have questions, it's free to ask. And if you're asking me also, um, my favorite dessert, you already know, I think. <laughs> rock jam rock. What's my favorite dessert? <laughs> so let us, I'm gonna question if um, someone know what's my favorite dessert. If I got that, I have a favorite food and also I had my favorite dessert so what is it guys mm. I love seafood but it's so expensive here Likewise, in here also rock and jam rock. It's very expensive. You know, it's not only the seafood. It's worse in now because everything it's you know price. It's getting high, so kind of expensive. But I love it. I love also seafood. I'm a seafood lover. Norman Spanish favorite place in Mindanao. Um, favorite places in Mindanao. I'm not quite sure because if you asking me the favorite place in Mindanao, because I've never been traveling to um uh, Dumaguete or Cebu yet. But as when I seen a uh, vlog in Cebu or in Dumaguete. I think in Cebu because I don't know when I see the vlog and they have a lot of nice tourist spot to you know um, hang out that's I'm kind of uh, wanted to go and explore that but if you're asking me about here in Mindanao uh, I'm not quite sure except my hometown my place of course I love it I love my my favorite hometown, especially uh, small countryside that I grown since uh, my birthplace. I mean, so I love that. So thank you so much for leaving a thumbs up, guys. Hopefully everyone will join our live chat. 
so that I know that you know you guys in here joining if you drop uh, you know just put hi hello or something like that that's uh, awesome George Blanket, I hope we can get together and go out and eat and get to know everyone a little better. Me, my wife, and you in the Spice Girls. That would be a good restaurant. Um, that would be nice, George Blanket, you know, um, with some of my Spice Girls friends and your wife. Okay, we would love that. Um, Hopefully one day when you're when you and wife in here in the Poland. So it's just um um you know letting me know so so that we'll know that um, you guys are here with your wife. When we get to come to the Polog, okay. So we will uh, wait that one day, uh, Mr. George Plunkett. But anyway, thank you so much for the invitation. So welcome to the Pollock Zone, George Plunkett. So it's been quiet now in here, guys. So this is one thing that I like also in this kind of apartment because here it's uh, I call this peaceful. You know, it's not like not like in the other my boarding house. It's so very noisy. Neighbor are so noisy. Um, you know, music too loud, you know, and people screaming and talking like, you know, so I'm so glad that here it's peaceful and quiet. So I love in here, guys. It's okay that I can hear the, you know, dogs bark sometimes. So that's uh, considering noise. Especially when you're here in province. <laughs> yes. Not not like us screaming and uh, music too loud <laughs> and your neighbor. So the air fares are so high right now. I think people are waiting for prices to drop. Yes, I think so and this is also um re uh, main reason because the fare was very expensive at the moment guys and you know hopefully when more aircraft you know will open will operate so that you know also the prices of ticket but i'm not quite sure guys if they're gonna get back in low prices because um the petrol the gasoline here it's very expensive than you know it's like expensive than a dollar more dollar so very expensive so yes guys in all the food or you know another cost of expense you know that getting higher because of the the things that you buy you know it's expensive so nowadays we are still increases everything is expensive so. Lee Hill you ever been to Bohol, Iloilo, Palawan there are many places I want to visit when I travel to Philippines 
Mm, I've never been to Bohol, Ilo, Ilo, Palawan. I've never been that place, but um, I've been to Boracay, Boracay, Hundred Island. That's in Hundred Island was very beautiful. Also, I that my first time I snorkeling, enjoyed sightseeing with the Hundred Islands. So. In, in Boracay, that time, it's like uh, they have a night nightlife that time. So you're gonna, ex uh, you know, um, how do you call that? Enjoy also. So in Palawan, hopefully, I love it. So that's also my bucket list to go to Palawan, El Nido, um, in Iloilo, Bohol, so Cebu. It's on my bucket list and also Shargao. I love it. I have a lot of bucket lists, but I stuck in here. <laughs> stuck in here. I stuck in here because nowadays expensive another expensive when you go traveling and part of that I have work so but hopefully I can explore. Jandi, my wife and daughter are still planning on spending June there in Bipolog. We bought ticket a year ago from ESAP. Oh, okay. So, I think that's a good planning. Um, Jandi, you know, we'll see. Maybe Trevor travel restriction releasing that you know month so but hopefully people cross you know we we'll, we'll still keep pray, praying about that and yeah we will see you guys soon uh, we will come you in the column Hopefully we won't have a war. No, hopefully. Hopefully we still uh, keep praying, guys, no matter what, you know. Um, instead of just making love, supporting our other country, it's not giving a war. It's not the, that solution, you know. We're just, you know, enjoying life instead, not just giving a war, you know. Enjoy your night, Marianne. I have to go now. Hope you see you next time. Okay, thank you so much, Ricardo. Thank you for being here again. Have a good day. Thank you. God bless you too. Stay safe. Good night. Yes. And I don't know where is my friend. I'm not quite sure. My Filipino friends my colleagues before in manila i don't know if you're still in here watching all my video and my live because they're not showing in my live but anyway i'd like to shout out to that all of my friends um thank you i know you guys been also um joining been here in my channel so I still appreciate that, guys. Thank you so much. You have a great week. Thank you so much, George. You too, with your family, with your loved ones. Have happy dreams. Okay, thank you, Mr. George. You also, and say hello to your wife. So, please don't hesitate to join, guys. I know I have only few of my subscribers joining our live chat. I don't know if it's the other, but hopefully. 
um, you guys will join. Don't be hesitate. Filipino vlogger is here. <laughs> we love to hear. And, you know, if you guys had a question, something, doubt that you want to ask me. So, I am here. If I will, uh, if I read all your comment, guys, I just get close to my phone, and I need to scroll down. <laughs> I look forward to your live stream each week since I found your channel. I am listening while doing other things. Thank you so much, Lee. Um, thank you so much. I still appreciate it that a lot you know even you know you're doing something but you're still listening so thank you so much lee god bless you always good night good night george good night uh god bless So let us wait for the others guys and you know it's okay for me we want to talk to you in a more more minutes because i don't have work tomorrow so it's okay it's okay with me <laughs> it's okay too late to sleep at night um because i don't have work tomorrow so um, probably woke up around 8 a.m. 8 or 9 a.m. something if I don't have work so it's a bit lazy lazy in the morning <laughs> lazy cozy in the morning in my day off I'm busy feeding dogs and chickens I tried watching on my phone but I can't figure out how to work chat. Remember, I'm <laughs> Mr. John D, thank you so much. I also appreciate that. Even you also doing <laughs> feeding your dogs. And um on the phone I think it's it's uh easier also that they have I call it you can click the live chat below so i think it's it's gonna pop on on your phone so yeah hopefully uh, but anyway thank you so much um john D. rock jam rock when are you going to a video showing how you climb no i apologize i'm not gonna do that mr rock jam rock I want to do that. I don't know how. So yeah. So you can see that not that. So yeah. He's fully quiet. So I know I have a lot of my new subscribers in here. Um, if you guys want to know about me more or you guys take back a look at my pre previous video that I had. So and thank you so much if you had a time to um, looking on my previous video.
I was joking. It's okay. It's a petty joke. Yes, guys, is anyone? Church blanket, are you off work tomorrow? Yes, I am off work tomorrow, day off. So every Monday is my day off. And I'm gonna wait also next month. I don't know, I don't have a schedule. Coffee is not cold. Oh no. Coffee is cold. Yes, guys, is anyone who will join? Please don't forget guys, if you had, you know, it is free to join our live chat. Just say hi, hello. Because I'm not quite sure if you guys in here, especially on my new subscribers. So, um, John D, who's going to take care of your mom while you're gone? Um, my brother, so my brother is still there. He's he live with my mom, so um, I just gonna leave allowance for whole month and also her medications for one month. So I'm gonna make sure that everything is um, everything he she needs is there, you know, before I go because um speaking of that going in the market so uh they can also buy in the polanco they just only the hubble hubble driver will do that because i have my my uncle my cousins driver in hubble hubble so i do a favor to um buy a fish or vegetables in the market of Mer in polanco so that kind of comfortable with me so my brother is still there looking if you know just kind of so So that's only a bit worried with me if I am far with my mom because you know but one month I think it's okay and hopefully my training would not undergo one month you know maybe two weeks or three weeks hopefully you know. hopefully everything will be fine guys How old is your mom? Um, she will be 71 this coming May, May 8th, so she will be 71. Jerry's blanket, everyone that can should send you a little money so you can go small trips and video fun times for us to help you a little um thank you for that george blanket for your offer um, yeah if 
if you know you can have that you can explore with the girls spice girls so this is now uh it's not kind of we had a plan to explore because you know it's like carmela and judiana also of course they want to explore we love to explore with the girls but nowadays it's expensive to go travel so we kind of stop doing that <laughs> trip so yeah and we are focusing on work but we still contact with the girls but my friends spice girls you know they are you know I say when we're going to next explore and they say oh we just keep learning that's it <laughs> So, yeah. But hopefully, well, I still wanted to go back to that very nice resort called Infinity Pool. Um, it so lovely to explore there. But that's far, you know, it's very far. In gasoline, it's very expensive. Oh my god, it is crazy, guys. Yes, and everyone would uh, join me in here, guys. Rock, jump rock. When you live in Manila, did you go back to the Polog often? No, um, before when mom was not a stroke, um, I was visited like, uh, not every year, like in every two years, once a year I go visited with my family in here in Dipolo because uh, ticket was very so expensive also. And uh, since he was stroke, so I was kind of visited a year like twice you know because i was just um get and uh, you know my auntie to have a look in you know um paying with her so i did twice a year at that time so that's gonna you know it's not easy because the ticket every time i go visit expensive so so that's the time that uh, when, when she was stroke, I visit twice a year and then I decided to quit our sign that job and transfer here in our province in Dipolo. So it's kind of big, you know, wages is different in here, but at least, you know, I can see mom once a week you know and i was always you know um how you call it um knowing here situation you know it's kind of difficult within manila you know it's very hard so lucky and i'm so blessed that i got this job you know thank you so much god is always good at the time so yes New subscriber can turn off ad blockers. Click play or let them run. Come back and thumbs up <laughs> later. Learn from pool old dog yesterday. <laughs> is it is it uh pool old dog doing that? <laughs> Just all let them running the. The videos and the ads <laughs> wow thank you for sharing that Janti. <laughs> no but i think it's not gonna in computer i think but in the same phone i know i don't think so probably were they were spam <laughs> they were spam on my youtube on my phone yeah so we have family in Dipolog and Salog. Ah, in Salog. 
Salog. It's not quite far from the Polog. Mm. They have a lot of um, fruits. How do you call that? Uh, mangustin or marang in Salog. <laughs> Is your wife, they have a lot of mangustin fruit in Salog. <laughs> George. Uh, it is more expensive on the trike or habal habal since the gas price went up and um yes it is but uh they don't force to give fare like you know even here around the city you know it's just in every corner you know it just like it's not so far but if they give you 15 pesos or 20 pesos it's okay but when out of the polog if you ride on habal habal yes it may cost you a little bit more higher than that because of that you know gasoline if it's around the city it's okay because i mean the passenger drop you and that corner and then suddenly they will they have all the a passenger you know always back and forth around the city but when out of the polo especially in other barangay it's hard to pick a passenger so they may cost you more fare Marian how is your boyfriend no I don't have a boyfriend Manoj Fernando still single So, um, does anyone want to ask the questions in five minutes? In five minutes, I think I have to go. I don't know, that's me, that keeps me single. And if you're asking me why, if you try to get back, have a look on my previous video, this is the main reason that um, um, it's not been scared. But I don't want that to happen again. Hello, Dave71. Good morning to you, Dave. Welcome. It's been a while. Hope you're doing good. Greetings from Germany. Yes, I know it's been a while. You missed my life in all my video, I think. <laughs> Where have you been, Mr. Dave? <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for leading back in my life how are you today uh day i'm fine friend I'm just joking i'll be wish Okay, um, there's like seems to be a lot of more cars in the Philippines than a few years. Yes, it's true. Uh, they have now, it, even here in the Polo, you know, um, it's not like way back two years or five years ago. It is, uh, you know, it's almost like been in manila like it's not been in manila but it's like growing city because you can see a lot of cars tricycles more and more and now the the tuk the hotel that's we call bao bao the tuk tuk it's a lot more in the road so yeah i'm so happy to see that and hear that You'll be okay. Take good care of yourself. Thank you so much, Dave. You too. Yes, guys. It 
sounds like um, you are busy and you live uh, Mr. Dave. How was it in Germany? So I think it is now. So we just wait in a few minutes, then I'm gonna. Um, I need to go, guys. I need to rest. And rest in a beauty rest that keeps me up. <laughs> keeps me up. Sleep more and eat well. That keeps you young. <laughs> It's okay, very cold here, but the sun is shining. <laughs> wow! Even, well, even, even the, there, there's a sun shining, but it is cold. <laughs> it is cold. Uh, yes. Good night. Uh, Fernando have a great have a good week Mary Ann okay you too Dave thank you so much time for me to get ready to bring my daughter to mass and uh, catechism so I have to go see you next time God willing okay thank you so much John D. So I'd like to say uh, thank you everyone who will be here um, joining our live chat. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. Thank you for supporting this channel uh, by watching all my video. So I'm gonna catch some ZZ night. <laughs> so thank you so much for your time. I so appreciate it. Thank you and God bless you all. See you guys in my next live every Sunday at 9 p.m. Philippine time. God bless you all. Good night.